guys, this is Marishi, you're my channel Chiluka. I've already pulled out five cards to see what is the story which you wanted to come through for this week. We've got the two of cups in reverse as with this card. The tower card, seven of reading is the king of pentacles. We've got the judgment and the last card is the seven of wands in reverse. Behind the deck is the eight of pentacles in reverse. When I broke the deck, we've got the princess of wands. Okay. Aries out there. Something is not working. If I, if I could just put it very mildly, something is just not working. Okay? And I feel like you're okay with it now. Like now, uh, you're just okay with it. You're surrendering to the situation. You don't want to make it work anymore. Because something has been said. I don't know if it's your story or the cross watcher's story, but somebody has put it out there that it's not working, okay? This is in regards to this commitment, the two of cups. It could be a relationship, it could be a financial situation, a, a job situation, a business situation, whatever it is, it isn't working out. And somebody doesn't want to put in the effort anymore, okay? Even with the seven of wands and reverse, they, they're just not bothered anymore. They're okay with it. But the way it was just put put out, uh, it had a huge impact. You know, it shook up your world or their world because it was, you know, it was said through a trumpet. It's almost like, you know, sending out a word to the world. This is how it's going to be. I'm literally wanting to shake things up. Okay? Yeah. It's almost like a final verdict. Hmm? This will affect... <sighs> your future somehow. The stability of your future. Some of you might be dealing with an earth sign person. Or a water sign person. A cancer, probably. Feels big somehow. Okay? The impact of putting it out there that it is not working anymore is going to have a huge impact. Okay? To whoever is involved. Maybe it's going to shake up the person whom you're going to say it. You know? Uh, let's call it quits. It's not working out between the two of us. We are done. So, yeah. As simple as that. Okay. And it feels like you're going to let everybody know this is how things are. Shit is hitting the fan right now for you guys, okay? With whatever is um, happening, it's wild. Anyways, eight of pentacles and reverse. Things are not working out. Somebody doesn't want to offer anything, okay? Mm, you know, because we don't have anything to offer anymore into this relationship. We were a little lost, uh, not knowing how to go about things. Uh, but they're working on this, okay? And it seems like um, you're taking the help of other people um, to actually execute what you're deciding on, okay? Somebody is helping, helping you out to make this decision because you need the guidance to how to go about it. So if you're calling it quits, uh, if you're going for the divorce or if you are, you know, a dissolving a partnership, a business partnership or whatsoever, okay, you are taking the guidance of another person, a lawyer probably, an advocate, yeah, and it seems like uh, you're not compromising, you just want to put everything out there, this is how it's going to be, okay, you're not being kind, Coming out very fierce right now. 
not willing to listen anymore. You don't want to listen. Because uh, the reason for you to turn out like the Princess of Swords in reverse, kind of a little bitchy right now, like, you know, mm, I'm not in the mood to listen to you right now. Uh, that's it, this is what I want. So let's call it quits. So the reason is because um, of what was going on. Okay, when they were together, what was going on? So whatever happened in the past, because this person is looking into the past, okay? It's uh, very anticipatory. This person doesn't want um, the past to leak into the future. That's why they're coming out very much aggressive. Okay, there is an aggressiveness about this person. Hmm? We kind of are very much defending what they have. Does that make sense? They are letting go of something because they want to protect what they have. It could be the family. You might have a family, children, etc. So um, maybe your assets as well with the King of Pentacles. Your assets, financial as, uh, assets. So you are very protective and you don't want to compromise or show any kind of sympathies because you have to think for yourself first. Hmm? And you don't want to fight anymore. You don't want to put up with the crap anymore. I want to say you were in so much conflicts for so long with this other person. Whatever the situation was, it was very conflictual. Styling, okay, and you, you were very disappointed with whatever was happening and even there was lots of regrets because things were going on behind your back, okay? People might have been deceiving you um, in the name of love, okay? And now that is a reason why you want to... Um, you know, break away from this person or the situation because it has been toxic, unhealthy. You don't want to be chained, uh, chained with this person anymore. That is why you're not willing to be with them anymore. It's going to, you know, you're just breaking apart. You know, and it will come out as a shock for everybody around you. They never expected you to part ways. And when that happens, when you're going to put it out there, this is how it's, it is. You're like, oh my God, we, we never saw that coming, okay? You don't want, uh, yeah? you're not expecting anything out of this person or situation. You don't want to go back there anymore, yeah? Seems like the person whom you're dealing with uh, thinks they still have a chance, okay? There is an arrogance about them with this emperor energy. And they still think uh, there is a chance to get back together, nine of cups, but that's not happening, okay? Their dream or their wish is not happening, how much ever they think uh, conf uh, they have this confidence about themselves, that things are going to be all right and they will have this four of wands. But it seems like um, yeah. they're simply convincing themselves everything is going to be all right, okay? Things are going to go back to where it was. We will be back together again. This is just a place. That's the way they are coming through. Like the emperor. I still have um, uh, power over the situation. The reason for things to fall out might be a third party, might be other people who is involved in your story. That is a reason for why they lost you in the first place, okay? Uh, this person whom you were dealing with might have other um, interest, okay? Outside the relationship, outside the two of cups, they had a third party going on with that three of cups. They might have been involved, as simple as that. Queen of Wands and the Six of Pentacles. They were actually... Mm, no, being reckless. 
if I can say it that way. They were being reckless. Transition, okay. I just confirmed that beforehand. Yeah. They might have been reckless, okay, within this relationship. Um, and I feel like Whoever this person is who's putting a full stop knew it, knew what was going on, and they were forgiving for some time. Okay? Unless, uh, until they couldn't take this anymore, they were a little forgiving yeah? with this person's attitude, misbehavior, whatever it is. Okay? Uh, this person was forgiving just because they wanted to keep their world intact, okay, and move on with their life. They thought things will um, transition, things will change for the better, but it didn't. They just didn't like what was going on, okay, King of Swords and the Chariot. Now they understood uh, they have to take charge of their life. Some of you might be dealing with an air sign person. Uh, now they realize they have to take charge of their life and bring their life on track and if they have to do something about this They are going to do and that's what I see them doing Okay, with this judgment and the tower We're calling it quits. We're not you know defending this person anymore this partner anymore Because they're done with their bullshit. Okay, we're calling it quits with the knight of pentacles and reverse. It's a dead end for them They're ready to start over again not knowing where they're going but they're willing to take the chance in their life right now okay when this this is over they're just you know out in the wild you know it's a new situation it's a new life again they don't know how things are going to end up but still they're taking that chance okay because uh, they this person doesn't have a choice. They have to now. They have to be done with the, the other person and move on with their life. Yes. They feel like they cannot wait anymore with the Seven of Pentacles. They have given multiple chances for this person. Okay, they have defended this person for quite some time. Now they are like, fuck it. Not anymore. Okay. Another two sevens. They don't see this working out. They don't see this ch uh, person changing um, or making things better. That is why they're giving up and they don't want to wait anymore because um, everything has come to light. Okay, whatever secrets they were, okay, whatever they were up to behind this person's back, that has been revealed. That is the reason why this person thinks there is no chance on earth I'm going to stay with this person any longer okay I don't want to be with this person any longer yes exactly it's uh, the same flow with a moon card and this ten of swords this person has been betrayed and they have realized didn't the moon card come to yes so the moon card and the ten of swords okay whatever has been revealed they understood this person has been cheating on them betraying them deceiving them not once, not twice, not thrice, multiple times. There's ten swords on the back. Okay? Literally come to wit's end. They're literally done. Putting up with them. Okay? Now they're deciding. This person is deciding uh, what needs to be done. Okay? The magician is somebody who will manifest what they want. They will research it. They will make things happen and they are deciding on how to put a full stop to things with the six of swords that is why I'm saying with this judgment and the tower someone is deciding to be done with this relationship yes half it is all about structure having this foundation the marriage you know the partnership everything to do with being official and this person is researching on how to bring a full stop okay this card for me is a titanic which has already sunk no point taking it into the water you're going to drown anyways so for them it is over the chapter is closed so they are literally researching on how to be done it is very overwhelming right now but 
we have realized not to juggle the situation anymore not to give it any more time they don't want to you know try and work on bringing in a balance again for them it's not going anywhere hmm? yes two of pentacles and the princess of pentacles um, it, even if they try to you know uh, work on it okay it's going to be a challenge it's going to be a burden which is going to be you know which is going to weigh you every step of the way and you don't want to carry that burden you don't want to carry the burden of the other person anymore because it's just not working out hmm? yes it's it's very overwhelming it's very overwhelming okay to put a full stop to uh, you know to pause the wheel to leave it in the past it's very overwhelming for you it's something new for you so you're researching how how to go about things what needs to be done yes to put the past in the past the six of cups is something which you had with the other person beautiful memories beautiful past with the other person but it's frozen in the past now it's not there anymore in the past so you are wanting to stop the wheel in the past it's of wands and the queen of swords the way you're going to deal with this situation is almost insensitively okay the way you're coming through to have or get what you want is you know very icy okay you're hell bent over you know making this happen you know you're not compromising i saw that with the princess of swords as well and i showed you like you know the nine of wands yeah sorry about that yeah so you're not willing to compromise anymore okay it's always like you need this you need this uh, if you don't grab onto this opportunity now you are never going to get out of this okay it's going to repeat and repeat and repeat and you know you will be never uh, you will never be able to get out of it okay so you you're fighting you're fighting to get what you want so much stress going on okay you're losing um you're losing your mind over this yeah. you're losing your mind over how to put a full stop yes you have no intention in coming back this is a no u-turn kind of a card for me once you've walked away you have no intention to come back from this I get the ten of pentacles. You don't want this uh, person in your future. Just walking away. Yes, you're letting it go. For some time you were holding on to this. Okay, very tightly. But now you're just letting it slip off. Not bothered anymore. Okay. Uh, in your headspace, everything is imbalanced. Everything is messed up. You can't think straight with these two cards. Um, you don't trust your intuition as well. You're not listening to your inner voice. It's almost like you're losing your mind. Okay, with this nine of pentacles. How things are going to be, blah, blah, blah. All right. You're very stressed out. Okay, with, the, with this prince of wands in reverse and the ten, uh, ten of cups. What will happen to you after you, you know, you put a full stop? You know in this relationship okay of having this family together what you always had okay unhappy yet yeah. unhappy but you don't want to go forward with it but you have researched this situation you have assessed the situation and you know that's what you need to do okay you have to give up on that you have to stop working on this you know it for a fact because that clarity has come through once you shown the lamp in the dark it is bright and clear just like the sun okay if you look at this hermit he's literally shining the lamp in the dark in the night okay so you've got your answers for some time you were just hanging in there losing your mind not knowing how do i get out of the out of the situation what do i do about this that is why i showed you the high pieces and the hangman uh, hangman together in reverse so you just didn't know just thought you know 
everything is going out of your hand. I, I don't know how to deal with this. But now, when you look at this whole thing, you assess the whole thing, you know exactly what needs to be done. And you're going to do it. Not fighting this anymore. You're not going to defend this person anymore. That's it for now. This is Marishi Yomachan Shiloka. Until next week, bye-bye.